lot. All right, let's do it. I'm hacking in. Look at that. Secrets and lies floating in a cloud of data. I just reach out, pluck it from the sky, and it's mine. It's ours. Stay focused. We got a nasty security system. How much we got? A hundred grand in 30 seconds. God bless the rich and famous. We are the modern day magicians. Siphoning bank accounts out of thin air. Can you hear yourself? <laughs> I think someone else is hacking in. Let's take a peek. Let's not. Stick to the plan, Damien. Second the accounts and get out. Adventure, my boy. Have faith in your mentor. Something triggered that alarm. Let's find it. Shit. The system. I'm almost there. I'm shutting down now. Don't you touch a thing. What the hell is that? We need to abort. It's over. I'm disconnected. Maurice. Yeah? You're on. One of our contractors ran a search for the hackers in the Merlot job. You're assigned Aiden Pierce. Take him out. Hit the family if you need to. This guy's hacking days are done. Hit the family? Not a problem? Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. you ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Some things you can't walk away please, from. Please! Who gave the order? I spoke to them on the phone and they told me where to find you. That's all I know, man. That's all I know. Give me a name. I don't know! A name! Kill me, man. Just fucking kill me. How's your memory now? Uh. 
Shaking, motherfucker. Shit! Where the hell you been? What? He's talking to me. I leave you for two minutes. Give me my bullets. I tossed them. But you said you'd kill them otherwise. I told you to hold on to them, Jordy. Where you been, anyway? I had to make a call. And you get what you need from Maurice? Oh, you're kidding me. Let's clean this mess up. Stop admiring your work. Hey, that's cute and all, but I'm disappointed, Pierce. I mean, you failed to spot the nasty inter-gang drama I'm creating here. I don't like loose ends. Let's get him out of here. No, too late. Bottom of the eighth. Chicago's ahead. Game's almost over. We are out of time. Huh. Nice shot. Huh. Come on, you're not just a little interested in my phone call. All right, fine. Tell me about your phone call. Glad you asked. Okay, we got a bunch of dead bodies, right? We got 40,000 people above us. We need a distraction. I called the cops. You did? Oh, yeah. True story. So, cops arrive, and Maurice's little band of brothers arrive, and pow, 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 pow. Jordy, tell me you're joking. No, no, I called them, too. Look, we get a messy altercation at the end of the game. You and I slip away undetected. You'll appreciate the plan tomorrow. Great. Punctual cops. I handle these guys. You grab Maurice, get him out of here. Maurice? What do I look like, a chauffeur? He's the shooter. I'm not through with him yet. Hey. Ugh. Dick. Chicago police! If there's anybody in here, identify yourselves. Anybody here? Definitely a viceroy. Here's the weapon, gunshot wounds. I got another corpse, another viceroy. <laughs> Victim this crime, then. Why'd they have to pick the biggest game of the season to pull this shit? I'm trying to warn it for everybody? Squad, we've got two bodies in the basement of May Stadium. Roger the polls now by Jorge Sanova, who ended with an outstanding 15-7 record last season. We're watching an epic confrontation between two old rivals here today, and this game couldn't be any closer. Big base steals on this team with 27 steals this series, but Sanova's watching them like a homicide. That's a pitch and a hit, and it looks like... Yeah, that's a foul ball. Roger's not falling for that one. Both men, of course, experts at the mind game. Two on, two out, folks. Something's gonna give soon, and it could go either way. Sonova pitches. That's a big hit! See anything? Nope. Quiet here. You've got a known vice boy in the VIP round. We're gonna check him out. Okay, I'm coming up. He's not moving unless I give him a reason.
just talking. Look, I got my tickets right nope. here. No, keep your hands where I can hey, see them. Hey, this is bullshit, Jay. You do nothing wrong. Get back now. You're vice wars, aren't you? That ain't illegal, right? Don't get smart. Bad boy. The police are about to lock this whole place down. I'm stuck unless we create a major distraction. I want to cut the power and slip past them. To the whole stadium? I thought you wanted to keep the vigilante out of the news. Everything's connected to the CTOS with serious firewall. Right now, I need to get out of the stadium. Can you find me the nearest access point? In the next room. Well, you'll need to find someone with security clearance. Security guard should have access. All these cops, there's gotta be one around. Plan, right? Of course we do. Good, we need to get moving on it. We're not gonna evacuate 40,000 people so we can play cowboys and Indians. But you got an isolated incident in the basement, we can close the basement. I got no problem with that. This whole place is about to fill up with Chicago PD. That's gonna cause a panic. We need to shut the game down and get people out of here safely. We shut it down, I... I can't make that call. Well then call somebody who can make that call, please. Okay, hang on. Yeah, get me Barry. Uh, uh, what... I'm not 
was bad. Finally got the goddamn trigger man. Just need to break through. How? Push Maurice hard. Torture's not gonna work on this guy. So I need to get inside his head. The guilt is eating him up. I'll give him a couple of days. I bet I'll start reaching out.
sick of remembering her that way. It's never a dream of her tiny face pressing the window when she knows I was coming over. Or that little wobbly dance she did. It's always the same nightmare. 